Real quick, I'm going to show you how to get started with Google My Maps. You can go to google.com slash maps. When you're here, you can go ahead and click create a new map. But I have one right here that I already made, so I'm just going to click into that. Now, to get started by bringing some data into your map, you can just go over here and click import. So this is pretty simple of an interface. If you have anything with coordinates, you should be able to drag and drop it over here. In this case, I have a 2024 July Baltimore crime data set. So we'll look down the various columns I have. It's already detected my latitude and longitude. So those will be the columns that position the data. And then here, if I want a column to title my markers, I would pick that. So I could use something like the description. I'll go up and I'll pick out, let's see, crime description. Okay, and I can always check my schema first to decide what I want to pick for that. From there, we'll go ahead and you'll see all the data on the map. And you'll be able to click on a point. And you'll be able to look at the information within. From there, we could go ahead and we could style and group things together. So let's say that we wanted to see if there was a weapon involved. We could go ahead and say group by weapon. Okay, this would set everything up to show the weapon type. And that would help color the symbol. So we wanted to pick like firearm. But so by selecting all of those records, they're all sort of highlighted here. You see all these kind of magenta ones. Blunt object, we could pick those. And what we could do even is change the color or the icons within. So if we wanted to change any of this, if we wanted to say, you know, if we wanted to change this to any other icon, we could do that. We could change the styling as well to just any other gender. So for gender, yeah, female crimes, male crimes, NA or unknown. And all those you could change with styling as well. Now you can do labeling as well. And then right here you can go ahead and you can put maybe weapon as a label. Now that's just a basic start, but I just want to give you a few 